Whether you've just installed Pendo or you're a seasoned user of the product, Tagging Features provides you with a great view of your feature usage. Today, I'm going to quickly walk you through how to tag features within your product. With that, let's get started. We'll be starting from the Features page within Pendo. From here, we'll want to jump into our Features in-app designer using this button in the right-hand corner. Today, we'll be actually working from our partner account, Spring Engage. First off, we can take a look at what features are currently tagged by clicking here. You'll notice that they are color-coded based off activity. Additionally, you can hover over any of these for current metrics. Next, let's tag a feature. Click Tag a Feature here on the left-hand side. You'll now notice that anything I hover over is highlighted with a red border. This is important as it helps you understand what the tag is capturing. If I'm looking to capture clicks on this one button, I can select here. However, if I want to capture clicks within this entire bar, I want to choose a parent element which captures all of these elements. For this example, I want to capture activity on this button. Once I've selected it, I'm now able to name it. Additionally, I can select whether I want to capture activity of this feature specifically for this page, or if I want to capture it for any pages in which this feature is present on. In this section labeled Element Matching, it displays the rule which we will use to filter out for feature activity. It always defaults to the suggested match. If you want to pull out and capture a bigger area, you can also select the parent element here. When we select a parent element, you'll notice the box expands to capture a greater area, moving up the div tree. Finally, in the section on the right, you can actually choose to add custom CSS and create your own selector to capture feature data for a specific element. Now that we've decided on that, let's save it. You'll notice it will pop up with a gray box around the element as it processes through the data. But in a few minutes, you'll have all the activity for the life of that feature since the installation of Pendo. That's it. Now it's time to tag some features of your own. Start with the features you are most interested in and move down the list from there. Remember, all of your data is retroactive, so you won't be missing out on anything. Please visit our support page at support.pendo.io for additional how-tos and FAQs. And feel free to reach out to us at support.pendo.io. Happy tagging.